Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with a Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial. And this tutorial is kind of geared at people who just moved up from iMovie and you're looking for the voices, the high pitch, the low pitch, the robot, the alien and things like that. So let me go ahead and show you where they are. All right, first thing I'm gonna do is uh, grab a piece of video, make sure it's in the timeline. Let's split up this clip a little bit. So we have a couple pieces and we can apply some audio effects to it. So the first piece here, we're going to go ahead and click on that. You're going to go all the way to the right side here. And you're going to select on this show or hide the effects browser right here. Okay. And there's all kinds of effects here. What you can do is go straight down to the bottom and look for voice. Or if you wanted to, you could actually search as well. But let's make it easy. Just go through voice. And then you have all these voices, the alien, the bright, the cartoon, the cosmic and uh, pitch, things like that. So, so let's go ahead and start with Alien here. I'm gonna click on that. Drop it on the clip there. So we have an Alien on that one. Next, let's do Helium. That sounds good <laughs> in this section here. In this tutorial, we're gonna show you how to do those funny. All right, and let's go ahead and move the pitch. That's a good one here. Grab pitch, and we'll drag it on this one here. And to control any of these audio effects here, we're gonna click on the clip you wanna control, go up here to the speaker icon, and it's gonna give you a little bit of a control here. So right now I'm on the pitch here, and you can increase it or decrease it. So let's go ahead and bump it up a lot. And let's go ahead and hit play. Or if you want to go in reverse, let's go backwards. And of course you want to listen to it to make sure you can actually understand it. But there's all kinds of things in here that you can kind of mess with. Transformer, voiceover enhance, uh, robot, multi-tune, yeah, all kinds of stuff like that. But again, I wanted this to be quick for all those people that are switching from iMovie to Final Cut Pro 10 and needed to know where their functionality was. Alrighty, as usual, I want to thank everybody for watching. Don't forget, peace and aloha. We'll see you in the next video.